This is going to be part storage, part fabrication. We would have built this building bigger if we could have, but we were pretty much constrained. There's some petroglyphs up there uh, to the northeast that we couldn't take out of the ground. We had to leave those there. And of course, you've got the old office that we just north of us. So this is as big as we could build it. And we added additional offices here. The intention is that they can stay there permanently, but they can also be removed if need be so that you can make this all into storage after the turbine generator project is over in about 15 years. The intention is that we're gonna put racks against that wall and be able to put parts storage against that wall. This entire parking lot area was originally a park and so it's now the new parking lot because this building sits and pretty well takes up the old parking lot. It's, it's always a challenge to come into an active work location like a power plant do a major construction project and ensure that you don't interfere with all of the operations of the power plant. There's some of the key interests of the district that maybe the contractor wouldn't think of. And so, you know, not interfering with the powerhouse, protecting the uh, petroglyphs, the fact that the Priest Rapids Fish Bypass construction has been ongoing this entire time. I, it was a lot of fun. This is a good group of guys that work here at Priest Rapids, and they worked well with us. And you can see that we've got a great finished building, so when everybody sees that's what's coming, I think they're pretty excited about it too. They're, they're real happy to have that much inside work area. So they were happy to see it. The contractor worked with us pretty well, so all the way around it just was a very, I really enjoyed the project.